people use ready rod bags now and obviously it's a massive time saving piece of kit that you can use when you go to matches or even just pleasure sessions it's great to know your rods are already set up in a hard case holder like this one one of the questions I, I get asked quite often really is about packing your rods away two piece rods are really quite simple to pack away obviously you just break them in half and put a couple of bands around them but I do get questions about three piece rods they're obviously rods that I use in the longer versions 12 feet and, and longer or 3.6 meter and longer and they can be a little bit awkward to pack away and the thing with that is obviously you can spend a lot of time at home just kind of packing them away but you don't really want to be spending extra time on the bank packing it away and the downside is if you don't pack it away properly when you get to the bank quite often you can find it's you know it's tangled when you get out of the, get it out of the bag so you haven't really saved any any time the way that I pack three piece rods away is simply with two rod bands these are obviously the matrix ones one wider one for the base of the rod and a narrower one for the top end of the rod all I do is first of all I take any sort of bomb or um, lead weight or feeder off the rig I undo the the drag a little bit just so you've got something to play with and all I do then is I wind it up so that I've got about about a metre so I've wound that up so the swivel when the rig is about a metre from the end of the rod and all I do then is make sure the back wind isn't on because that can cause you tangles and cause you problems I'll just break the rod at the first section first and put that in line with the base of the rod I'll then put both straps around the base like that you should find that by leaving about a meter you've only got a little bit of line there which is great because it means that's not going to tangle inside your bag I then break it at the tip lay that back down on itself like that so that the most delicate part is facing down so that's going to be held against the rod stop it getting damaged so then you've got the three parts at the top all in line with each other so you wrap the narrow one around the end of the rod so that all three pieces are together parallel with each other nice and tight so they're not going to move the final detail is I turn the handle I'll try and do it that way for you I'll try, turn the handle to that position and that's because when I undo the handle at this end because these are these handles actually fold inwards when I undo it there that can simply fold inwards which I'll show you so I put the handle into that position tighten the drag back up because you don't want that coming undone in transit because that will again cause you problems I then undo that side which will allow the handle to fold inwards against the rod so it's in there out of the way and that obviously makes it narrower so it goes in your rod bag better and that way you'll find you can get probably up to you know multiple rods in a, in a carry hole like that nice and simple and when you get to your bank you know your rod's going to be all right simple yeah.